All right, uh, I've, I've just got a couple of observations. Uh, several of us came here particularly to try to core down on the mock effects. Not, not even mock effects, it, it, it's the whole EM drive business. Uh, we have a lot of people asking us about this. I mean, this is incredibly important to get this right. Okay. And uh, first of all, the retro causation theory that we've heard of. Uh, this is one of many, many interpretations of quantum mechanics. Uh, there is no canonical interpretation of quantum mechanics. You know, pe some people agree that this religion is right at quantum mechanics, and other people agree, and so forth. So, you know, there is no agreement. So, you, you know, they have used one interpretation or one approach to, to the understanding of, of, of quantum mechanics. Uh, we heard this morning what I think is a superb presentation by Hathaway. Okay, absolutely superb. And and, and what's interesting is he said, look, this is only part of it. Okay, and I, I I asked the JSC people. I said, you know, have you gone through? He had a special chart which, which we can go over. Of uh, these are some of the experimental artifacts and issues on on, on their particular thing. I didn't see a similar chart. He probably didn't show it for 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 gem stuff. Okay, and, and I asked him, okay, have you been through all this? Because the people at JSC have been beat on by the Jasons and some external committees that JSC brought in, you, you know, to look at all this. And, and when I checked, well, we haven't had time to go through them all and so forth and so on. Okay, so, it, it, you know, the current state of play seems to be that uh, the amounts from the mark effects being observed are still fairly small that uh, all of the experimental artifacts and issues have not by any means been addressed. And unless and until they are, okay, and the importance of this is so massive, okay, that I think we deserve it to the scientific people as well as to society, okay, to do our due ex objective diligence on this just as well as we can. All right, before we decide what's right, what's wrong, what's real, what's not, okay? Uh, the, the, the issue of the mock thing, uh, you know, I'm an engineer, I'm not a physicist, so I go read stuff. A and the, the tomes in physics, okay, uh, are not particularly kind, most of them, to the mock business. So along with the retro causation, there's the whole issue of the viability of the mock approach, okay? So there's a lot of issues here that I think need to be discussed uh, going forward and the people in this room are probably the best in the country or a great many of them, you know, to do that. And this is why I, you, you, you know, kind of prevailed and fussed at the organizers here. They came to me and they said, no, no, we got a schedule. We got to do this and so forth. And I looked at them and I said, this is supposed to be a technical meeting. It, it, you know, we're not here to salute schedules as far as I'm concerned, okay? We're here to sort out what's really going on with all of it. Thank you for listening.